And we're talking about this little pamphlet here, Understanding Secret Societies. For the most part, it's about the symbols, pentagrams, hexagrams, crescent moons, uh, crosses that we have in everyday life and that we associate with mostly religions. And uh, what they really mean. What do they mean? I did, yeah. So if you go through the history, the Bible paints a pretty clear picture uh, about one of Satan's main goals, and that is to mix man with beast, genetic engineering. And uh, we find this theme throughout Masonic imagery. Uh, these are the tower, uh, the pillars of Jenkin and Boaz. And you see a lot of DNA strands, uh, even in historical pieces of art. A lot of pentagrams, such as the uh, Mason square and compass there. Even the Rothschilds, uh, Rothschild means red shield. The funny thing about the hexagram is that if you calculate the angles of all of the triangles, the small ones and the two large ones, uh, the angles come out to 60 degrees each, 666. So there's a theme here with 666, uh, DNA strands, and even the chromosomes. We have a lot of symbols that correlate with either, you know, the idea that we're fusing uh, the sons, how it's said in the Bible, the sons of God with the daughters of men, so fallen angels with you know, human women, and they're trying to do that through DNA. And that's essentially what this extremely complex little pamphlet is about.